Alrighty, so today we are going to explore a new Tech Life kit that just came out. Uh, it comes with uh, a tool kit, uh, a hand tool kit, and it comes with a 20 volt drill. And I am seriously curious what this is because I do have the 12 volt uh, Tech Life drill and the 20 volt hammer drill. This is the drill that I've been wanting for a while just because it looks cool and I'm curious on how it performs. So we are going to unbox this bad boy and see what comes inside. Alrighty, so. Look at that. So it comes with a bag. And a hard case kit. Alright, let's I am curious. I want to spoil myself and I want to explore the drill first. It comes with instructions and a warranty card. That has to be the charger and this has to be the batteries. Let's find out. Yep, this is a battery. 1.5 amp hour battery. And so now I have a 1.5 and a 2 amp hour. Let's see, is this 1.5 is actually fully charged and so is the 2 amp hour. Wow. It's fully charged. Fantastic. And I think this is the charger. Yes, it is. So this charger comes like this. They do make another charger that is it's mounted on my wall right now. And so, yeah, it's a good traveling charger. So you just plug that in like that, and then you plug this in like that. And there you go. Then you are good to go. Now, I do love Tack Life's black matte finish. Look at this. Look at that. That is gorgeous. That is, I love the matte finish that they have on it. Uh, compared to, comparing it to the 12 volt one, I'd say roughly about the same size. I think the truck's the same size. Uh, so I think it's three eighths. You know, on the Tack Life hammer drill is the half inch. So this is interesting. So because as you can see, the different like uh, this one has a little bit of a glossier. <coughs> the 20 volt has a little bit of a glossier finish here and there compared to the 12 volt. But Tack Life's tools uh, feel really good in my hand because it's it's a nice good grip. Right, that is speed one, speed two. That is a nice quiet motor. It's a light tool, it is not heavy. But we are gonna test this out in this video and see how it performs. All right, so you got the, the battery, you got the charger, instructions, and of course you get the bag. Oh, and a belt clip. Get a belt clip. We gotta put the belt clip on. Perfect. There we go. This is a really nice. This is a really nice hard case. See, now when it comes to hard cases, I like hard cases when you have a lot of individual tools in there. N not for drills. I don't like hard cases for drills because it's a big bulky item that you got to get one item out of. Now for hand, for hand tools, it's good to have a nice hard case. Which I, actually, I, I like this hard case. So let's see what you get inside. Of course you get warranty card which luckily I got this well because I need scissors uh, I always, I was borrow, borrowing the scissors from the kitchen I just want to every time I go to Home Depot I forgot I forget what I need and now I have scissors for for the garage it's good to have a razor a little hammer a tape measure the tape measure goes to 10 feet Good to have uh it's good to have a little tape measure on you my wife actually has like a six foot tape measure in her purse got drill bits you have uh interchangeable 
screwdriver where you can put a different drill bit on there. You have many, many uh, screwdrivers, which these are always good to have because I always need these. And you got pliers. Now this this is a good little tool kit to have. Because even though I have a lot, even though I have a lot of tools in my uh, in my tool chest, no matter what, I I always seem to be having to find a certain tool, even though it's in I know where it's at. So it's that's why a hard case is good because you, if you need it, you take it out, and you if you take it when you do take it out, you know exactly where it goes. So I I do want. Uh, I do want to get tools that are in hard cases like this. Like this is awesome. You know, like to especially because especially cuz I have a boat, I don't want to have to take uh, like guess which ones I need. You know, I'd rather have a hard case like this and then just bring that on the boat if I need to work on the work on the on the motor. And yes, all you guys, I'm not a contractor, but I do my own mechanical work when it comes to certain stuff. Uh, my boat overheated last last year, and I fixed it uh, with with my tools. You know, so I I had to replace parts, I had to take uh, apart the cooling system, and I actually did fix it. And so I so yeah, I do use these tools. You know, I'm just not a I'm just not a contractor or a carpenter. I, I work on cars and boats. So so but it, this is a very good little case this is a very good little case I, I like that it comes with for a beginner it comes with everything you need it comes with everything you need so all right so what we are gonna do is we are gonna test out this 20 volt drill I'm curious on how this performs and first what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a 5 8 5 8 spade we're gonna use the we're gonna use the uh, battery comes with a 1.5. Now I have a mo uh, I have a two amp hour, but we're not gonna use that. We're gonna use the 1.5 because that's what comes with the kit. All right, so three, two, one, go. Switch it to a two amp hour. That's on speed two. Let's see if there's a difference in time between the 1.5 and the two. All right, so three, two, one, go. There we go. There is a difference between the 1.5 and the 2. Which a ha uh, the half inch does fit. All right, so 3 2 1 go. But this uh this Tech Life uh, tool kit is actually uh, a pretty good one. You get a cool case, so you get a 20 volt drill. Now we are going to conduct more tests uh, uh, in this in the future. We're actually going to do uh, Tac Life 12 volt versus 20 volt and see what the difference is. This kit costs $80. I'll put the link in the description for it uh, below. And, and yeah, it's good. I love this case. This case is actually a cool looking case. Now, like I said, I am not a fan of case of hard cases for an actual power tool. I like hard cases for the actual individual hand tools so you you know exactly where everything's at you don't have to scrounge for stuff you know just like the tech life socket set that i got imagine if that was just scattered all over the place it's all in one spot so i like that tech life does that they have a hard case for their instead of a soft case you know a hard case is good for their hand tools but yeah uh the rpms for this is speed one it is zero to 350 and on speed two it is zero to 1300 so we are going to test the crap out of this in the future. This kid is awesome. So that's pretty much it. So this is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in and I'll see you guys next time.